Hello, and welcome to the Dock Street Theater. My name is Donnie Newton, and I'd like you to join me as we take a look at this historic landmark. When the Dock Street Theater opened in 1736, it was the first structure built in America to be solely used as a theater. Before that time, barns, churches, and bars were used for performances. Tragically, the theater burned down in 1740 when a fire swept through much of the city's French Quarter. It was rebuilt and eventually turned into the sophisticated Planters Hotel in 1809. The hotel, frequented by racehorse owners, planters, and seafaring merchants, was remodeled in 1835 to add the sandstone columns and balcony that you see today. After the Civil War, the hotel became a boarding house before falling into disrepair by 1915. The city of Charleston acquired the building in 1935 and with the help of FDR's Works Progress Administration Initiative, restored the venue to that of an 18th century English theater. The Dock Street Theater officially reopened in 1937 with the play The Recruiting Officer, a nod to the first production produced at the theater when it opened in 1736. The theater is home to Charleston Stage Company, which produces a full season of shows every year. It is also host to organizations both local and international, including the Charleston Literary Festival, Moja Festival, Spoleto Festival USA, and more. We look forward to hosting performances at this historic venue for many years to come. 